Assalamu alaikum this is Dr Hasna back with another video for the subscriber week hope you all are doing well i am here to make your troubles easy this week i am releasing back to back uploads of your requested topics and non stop every single day if you have a topic you can totally request in the comments below and good luck for your exams guys today we're discussing the muscles of the sole of the foot because dorsum of the foot there's just maybe extensor digitorum brevis is the only muscle found there so the most of the muscles are coming in the sole of the foot and this is on your request basically i've been asked about uh, uploading videos on muscles so let's go ahead and talk about it shift your focus to the board so in the so foot i want you to remember that there are going to be muscles that are going to be uh, layered layer 1 2 3 4 and for this i've made a special mnemonic completely made uh, or you can say i am the founder of this mnemonic <laughs> and it was difficult to make one but like i've made it finally and i want to share it with you it goes like fahad which is an urdu name for the my international following this is for you urdu name pakistani name fahad goes to d h a for a long time what a beautiful story right let's continue the story what does he do in d h a it posts an ad fb on facebook so fb ad makes sense and then what does he do what kind of ad does he post all he does is writes a status that goes like i am on top that is ad he posts and that's the story that i want you to remember for sole of foot muscle uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to talk about what these muscles are so layer 1 consists of the f muscle this is the flexor digitorum brevis it flexes the digits makes sense because sole of foot is behind or posterior compartment continuation so obviously flexors are going to be here then we have a for abductor hallucis hallucis means the big toe and digiti minimi we all know is a tiny toe all right and abductor hallucis remember one thing that it lies on the medial end the big toe lies on the medial end which is in contrast to the upper limb again all right then we have the h h stands for abductor hallucis a d is for abductor digiti minimi so that is layer 1 makes complete sense next layer is the long layer it's going to have the longest is so digitorum longus flexor digitorum longus flexor hallucis hallucis longus and the flexor digitorum accessorius apart from that this layer contains the l muscles the lumbricals next layer is fp f b meaning flexor brevis is now these are the flexor digiti minimi brevis and flexor hallucis brevis if you uh, notice that these people were left out they didn't get any flexors only the digitorums the middle digitorums got a flexor on the first layer if you can remember that so these guys didn't get any so god was like okay fine let me just give you your own independent ones so anyway and one more thing ad 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 is the ad doctor hallucis so the thumb never gets the thumb or like the big toe never got any adductor because interosseous were given to all other fingers but to the thumb no adductor that's kind of unfair so the thumb asked god can you give me one then the god gave him the adductor hallucis all right next is the fourth layer fourth layer starts for very easy interosseous muscles and you just have to remember these muscles these are the tibialis posterior and the peroneus longus coming from the posterior compartment and the lateral compartment i hope you remember those now all i want you to do is learn the nerve supply this way i want you to write down f1 in lad not taking much of your time just write the f1 lad once you've written that guys only these muscles are supplied by medial plantar nerve the rest of all the muscles of the sole of foot are supplied by lateral plantar nerve if you can remember that you waste this you waste the sole of foot muscles origin insertion is literally nothing you just have to look at a diagram diagram so medial plantar nerve what are the f1s 1l i'm sure i'm sure you guys know 1l is the first lumbrical muscle supplied by medial plantar nerve obviously it's lying on the medial side and what else can be supplied by the medial plantar nerve medial side so toe so hallucis is right so the first thing is flexor hallucis and the a abductor hallucis get those out of the way the only thing we have to figure out was what's the d is the digitorum the poor guy named digitorum that got no nerve supply at the end of the day is going to be supplied by the medial plantar nerve and these are the only muscles you have to remember for this nerve all of the rest of the muscles are supplied by uh, the lateral plantar nerve so guys with that comes an end to our foot muscle summary topic this way uh, if you remember it's very good for you to learn stuff in a summarized manner when it comes to the end days or the revising days so make sure you learn that way and not go for like reading deep paragraphs happy subscriber week to all of you and if you want the recorded sessions of my summarized lectures within one hour completing lower limb thorax and upper limb uh, i have those recorded sessions kept with me if you need them let me know thank you so much for watching